All right, Rich. Okay, it's uh, time for another wheel of the worst. Let's get this over with. No, no, Rich. We haven't done one of these in a while. We have to. We have to explain what's on the wheel here. Before I know uh, when we've done the wheel of the worst, it's been a horrible disaster every time. But we do have to set this up properly. So okay. let's let's go through what's on the wheel here. We've got some old classics and some new things. Uh, first up is. Traveling Alone in America. Now, we looked at the back of this, and it seems to be some sort of Canadian production about the dangers of coming to America. There's plenty of dangers. And next up, we have Where Did I Come From, which looks like a cartoon about people having awkward sex. I think it's aimed at children, and I think the cum part is not an intentional joke. But uh, Next up, oh, God. Tom Parks in Diabetes, A Positive Approach. And this is like uh, Tree Stand Safety. This cover is sort of a little masterpiece. It's a good thing it's not called HIV, a positive approach. Oh. And then next up, we have the incredible, instant, boring boyfriend. Adoring boyfriend. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I, I thought it said. It, it's a yet boring. to be decided if it's boring or not, but I think this is some sort of virtual boyfriend where you put it in and he talks to you. For incredibly lonely women. I, but not just women. I'm sure there's some men that would be. That's okay. It. He, he looks like a handsome fella. Uh, introducing Kitten Commotion Seven Cute Cuddly Kittens. They wrestle, romp, explore, lounge, and play. So this is the laziest video that anyone has ever distributed. And, and the tape up next needs no introduction. It's the second most popular tape on this show, Tree Stand Safety. And hopefully, hopefully we'll, we'll, we'll land on that today. I hope so. I've been, I've been looking forward to Tree Stand Safety. And next up, we have one of the most mysterious tapes on the board. Uh, Dunkin' Donuts 1994 Fall Donut Event Finishing Video with Bob Rosenberg. Okay. Uh, okay. Well. Yeah. Oh God. <laughs> this oh, was God. sent to us and this is all it was, just you this know, label. You know what's gonna happen, right? The wheel is going to land on that instead of oh. our next tape, the Shoji Tabuchi Show. The most anticipated uh, video of all time. In human history. See, look at the baby's coming out of it. Mm -hmm. That's a vagina. Oh, yeah. There's, maybe there's oh, a lot of subtlety. Like, yeah, oh, it's like boy. symbolism. Yeah. Oh. 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 oh, oh cartoon baby so, Oh, that's... This person had sex with a lot of black men. <laughs> if we start at the top, you can see that the man has a flat chest. Oh. oh. There we go. Oh, she's bouncing. You were this is oh, weird. Your mother's breasts were rather like a mobile milk bar. And that's when the man puts his penis inside the woman. And what? <laughs> what? Two people can get. Oh my god. Yeah. It starts slowly, but gets quicker and quicker. As the tickly feeling gets strong, I want to hear the narrator get more like aroused and worked up as she's explaining. <laughs> when the man and the woman have been wriggling so hard you think they're both going to pop, they very nearly do just that. <laughs> All the rubbing up and down that's been going on ends in a lovely explosion. Yeah! Oh, oh. Come on. Wow. Have you done something to your hair? No. Is that a new dress? Take off your pants! <laughs> yeah. Let's just say that the, the few ex-girlfriends I have fall way short of you in the beauty stakes. In fact, they weren't even particularly nice people. So I can fully understand you wanting to say bad things about them. They totally deserve it. <laughs> <laughs> I will say beer come up my nose on that one. <laughs> this, is like, this is like a joke gift. Sure. I, I don't know, though. Oh, oh. I just oh. don't understand why women feel the need to keep taking off their clothes in movies. I mean, <laughs> not only is it absolutely degrading to <laughs> Nobody irons a jean skirt! <laughs> what is wrong with you?
Well, I know, I know why she wanted to keep using that thing because it was constantly rubbing her her crotch. Her clitoris. It was, yeah, yeah. It was rubbing her clitoris, which ties in with our second video. But she, yeah, that's the only reason that went on for sixty minutes. Uh, the video is called "Where Did I Come From." Sex education can be fun. You can make a video about us watching that video called How Did I End Up Here? Yeah, what's what's wrong with our lives? Well, it's, it's been noted though, sex education, not for like teenagers. No. This is sex education for like five-year-olds. <laughs> yeah, that gets into graphic detail. Which is the yeah. most, the weirdest thing about it is, yeah, it, it shows like uh, your parents, they fucked, they have sex, and they get worked up, and it shows these kittens as representations of penetration and speeding up and then finally ejaculating but it's all done in sort of a vague weird way where it's like a five-year-old is going to be so baffled by what any of this is supposed to mean <laughs> the duck is the weirdest because you see the the parents in the bathtub and it's like the, they stand up and the suds are covering them and it's like the suds are about to fall off and then you cut to this duck just like staring at their genitals he yeah. can't take his eyes off that guy's dick <laughs> he can't he's riveted yeah <laughs> Just like breasts, this part of the body has a lot of different names. You probably have a special name for yours, but the right name for it is the penis. Just like peanuts, without the teeth. <laughs> this dog right. just staring at crotches is really unsettling. At the same time as this tremendous big shiver, a spurt of quite thick, sticky stuff comes from the end of the man's penis. That's a lot of cum. <laughs> Did Nano tell you about the birds and the bees? No, nobody told me about the birds and the bees. It was all, all self-taught. The self birds, birds and the beads? Birds and the beads, right? Yeah. <laughs> there's, a, there's a bead involved somewhere. I've never had no, sex. No, that's, that's when anal beads. There's oh, anal beads. There's anal beads. Did you type, did you type, what is sex on Google? Or, like, and you just got <laughs> anal beads. Just, like, yeah. a couple weeks ago. Yeah. Amazon links that's to what, anal beads. You know what? If you can use anal beads with somebody, that's true love. That's true. <laughs> well, speaking of anal beads, let's talk about instant adoring <laughs> boyfriend. What, one thing we haven't done is, um, is, uh, read the back, which, which might give us some insight. Oh, sure. Uh, for a second, I hear, I thought it says, he's considerate, charming, homeless. <laughs> and, and gorgeous. I, I think he, he's definitely unemployed. We okay. discovered that. Uh, at last, the man who says all the right things. Okay. Uh, well, and we should also, in a bit, ha talk about the sexist angle of this. Uh, reverse sexism, because there is no video of the instant, incredible, adoring girlfriend. Yeah. Right? So, at last, a man who says all the right things, who is considerate, charming, gorgeous, and madly in love with you. Sounds too good to be true? Well, he's here, and he's all yours. After, after the, the, the cartoon Mommy and Daddy conceived, after that, it was all downhill. After was, the daddy came. After the daddy <laughs> came, an ocean of semen. <laughs> well, that's usually where men stop carrying anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. What? Let's, uh, let's get started. Oh. All right. First up is a new one. Um, uh, not quite sure how to pronounce this. Or, um, the Shojai Tabuchi. Does that have something to do with the Olympics? The Shochi Tabuchi oh, show? Oh, Sochi. Yeah. It gets a bronze medal for me. And then next we have Dunkin' Donuts 1994 Fall Donut Event finishing video with Bob Rosenberg. That sounds great. That sounds awesome. That sounds really good. Now, I know that this one is your favorite. So, uh, Florence Henderson's looking great, feeling great. I, I think if we land on this one, the little whammy's gonna come up in the bottom of the screen. No one's going to understand that reference. The, the, this, this doesn't look much better. Uh, kitten commotion. Seven cute, cuddly kittens. They, they wrestle, romp, explore, lounge, and play. So it's, it's basically YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Next up is fan favorite SOS. Fan favorite? Yeah, this is one that we we, we always keep passing by and never oh, land on it. Oh, that's the one, right, mm -hmm. right. And everybody wants us to watch it. Well, hopefully, hopefully it'll finally land on it this time. I, I mean, hope so. It's like the fourth I, episode we've done. I know. I, and we still haven't landed on SOS. So. I know. We need to land on it this time. Okay. And then we have Tom Parkson, Diabetes. 
a positive approach. So it's a very positive thing that you got diabetes, right? I hope I have diabetes now because my lifespan will be shorter and then I can die sooner. What's next on the wheel? <laughs> Tales from Genesis Space. I don't know what the fuck this is, but it looks amazing. And, and next on the wheel is my second favorite video of all time, The Art of Dining, The Business Lunch. The complete guide to dining etiquette for corporate go-getters, salespeople, professionals, executive horsewives, and anyone who entertains for business or social occasions. This guide will dramatically increase your social confidence when dining or as a host or guest. Meow. Okay, shut it off. <laughs> The cease and desist order. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it's a horror oh, film. Oh no, these I cats are scared. This. Oh, it's shot on someone's video camera. Yeah. yeah. This this looks like this doesn't look warm and cute. It looks like a like a like a serial killer's home video. <laughs> you know? It looks like a snuff film for yeah, cats. Like now, I don't know who made this, but I'm going to guess if they showed like an image of him or cut to footage of him, he would probably look like some sort of sex pervert. I just have a hunch. Ladies and gentlemen, would you please make welcome to the stage, the incredible Shoji Tobuchi! Um, oh, this is... This is unexpected. This is unexpected. This is amazing. Um, uh, what do we do? I don't know. Did we watch it? It landed on it. I don't know. I... Uh, I guess? That's a big crowd, though. Yeah. Shoji fills up a, a, a theater. Shoji's supposed to be popular down in St. Louis, Missouri? Branson, yeah. Branson, Branson Missouri. Missouri. Something like that. But before we go any further, I've got to wait here and see where everybody's from. How about our home state of Missouri? Where's Shoji? Texas! They're, they're dragging them out, Jack. They are. They know that's all anyone wants to see. Mississippi. I don't watch the Shoji Tabuchi show to not see Shoji Tabuchi. They're trying to get him cleaned up in the bag. <laughs> He's trying to get him sober. <laughs> yeah. They're giving him coffee and trying to wake him up. And... <laughs> Stall them! <laughs> Ask them where they're from! <laughs> I guess you call this not Shoji Tabuchi's yeah. show. Yeah, this whole thing is... No, it's a random ladies show. It's called yeah. the No Shoji Tabuchi oh, Show. Oh, see, that's good. Oh, Thank you. No, that's good. no Show. Yeah, no, she's a No Show. I get it, I get it. So, I, I, that's better than what we came up with. Oh. There it is! Oh, 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 oh my god, it's a laser film! It's a, it's a yes. 3D laser projection. It's the big moment we've all been waiting for. <laughs> this, be uh -oh, I saw, this is it. This has got to be Yeah, it. this has to be him. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, would you please make welcome to the stage, the incredible Shoji Tabuchi! Yay! 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 Everybody's going out and having fun. I'm just a poor girl staying home. Oh, he's terrible! <laughs> So 
is there anything else to say about kitten commotion? Uh, it's possibly the worst thing I've ever seen. How many yep. things have you said that That's about now, though? Everything. Well, okay. it's not the worst thing we've ever seen, but it is a kitten calamity. <laughs> <laughs> that was so terrible. <laughs> uh, what are you holding back? <laughs> a, a kitten calamity. Yeah, I was holding that one back. Pull your hair back and ham your pants. Weather name best on any. <laughs> oh my god. What is this? A Super Bowl show? <laughs> yeah, and that that I agree. They're a donut shop. <laughs> <laughs> Who cares? They gotta give these guys some reason not to kill themselves. Yeah. I mean, they work at a fucking Dunkin' Donuts. <laughs> Let's give them something to talk about. You're oh, 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 oh. And we're out. And that's done. And now, <laughs> Shoji. There's nowhere to go from there. I, I think you're just bitter at, at donut shops for making Krispy Kreme change his name. Aww. Krispy Kreme 2012. This is true. It makes me very sad. That's understandable. I love him. It's not even wish fulfillment for the manager. Like, I can see him putting it in, watching it, and they show the manager at the beginning, and no one respects him. And he's like, when we get our new uniforms, everything's gonna change. I'll be glad when those new uniforms get here. But then at the end of the video, he doesn't get the new uniforms in real life. So it's sort of depressing. <laughs> yes. You know what, though? I, I give it four stars. Out of 50. <laughs> I think we were hoping for a, like some kind of corporate training video, but yeah. it turned out, yeah. or or a video of the finishing event. Yeah. Or like a, a, video donut, of, a donut making or, a, a or donut a, making competition yeah. would have been great. Or a video of Bob Rosenberg finishing. <laughs> um, that could have been happening. It, it was a shot here's, from like the here's our new frosting. Bob Rosenberg's <laughs> last his last video before being fired. <laughs> He's just drunk and fucking donuts. I got some glaze for you. Time to fuck the donuts. Oh. <laughs> but they really build up the shoji, though. I mean, oh, yeah. you know, the, the wife comes out and they have like two different musical hacks. You're just sitting there. Where's shoji? Where is he? What's going to happen when shoji comes out? Yeah. And the, the laser violin starts spinning around <laughs> the stage. And then his name starts coming up in giant letters. <laughs> it's really awesome. And then you see these legs walking down the stairs, and there's lights behind him. And then he walks to the microphone. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Folks, we will try to do every kind of music there is. I'm sure it's a bunch. <laughs> was he drunk? Or <laughs> I, we, I, I think he was both drunk and English. Yeah. Oh, I, oh, I think it was both drunk English. Well, that's getting cut. Get ready. We put together a whole mess of good old Hoda music. Well, first up, we have uh, what was on the wheel last time, a mysterious tape called SOS, uh, which has a monkey in a suit. Yeah, whatever. Next up is Practical Solutions for Home Preparedness, Y2K. What a timely video. Yeah. Let's make a standard Y2K didn't happen joke. Um, up next will be a Y3K video. But we have a long time to wait before that. Rich, up next is another mysterious video, uh, Tales from Genesis Space. There's an eye with cat ears, a smiley face, and something that looks like an alien demon. Well, that looks amazing, so there's no chance we'll land on that. Next on the wheel is Insert Joke Here. <laughs> the Insert Joke Here video about insert joke here. Up next is cleared for takeoff. Correction, Fred Levine's original cleared for takeoff. Travel through one of America's largest airports and experience the fun of flying with a real pilot. Gee, I can't wait to travel through one of America's largest airports. That sounds so much fun. Next up on the wheel is farm safety family style. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> we, have, we have a large blue box. It says 
farm safety family style. But it also says 1343. Is that the year the film was made or the running time? That's the Bible verse that the tape is based on. Up next, American Flatulators. Uh, wow. This appears to be a parody of the dated TV show American Gladiators, just with fart jokes. And are they holding, is that toilet paper on the end of those? Probably. They look like giant Q-tips, but those are those, those jousting yeah, things that they yeah. I don't, I don't get the gas mask though. Is there, is there any kind of parallel on the American Gladiators logo that that's a take on? I know, I know gas for smelly farts, but. Mm -hmm. And then last up on the wheel is the big finish, kids in airbags. Things you don't want to go together, <laughs> ever. But in this video, it does. And the strange thing about this video is that it's only four minutes long. So I really, I can't wait to see how they talk. I think it's gonna start off, your airbag will inflate when you hit something and it'll hit your kid in the face. End of video, right? Or don't get in a car accident because your airbag could smack your little child in the face. Whatever. Fuck these videos. These all suck. What? You're so weird. Now let me put this safety instructional video about child airbag safety back on a wooden wheel so that we could spin it. I am Cog. I was reactivated in the year 3423 at 2301 Galactic Standard Time. Once I was reactivated, <laughs> I was confused. It was a strange sensation. I wasn't. Then I was. I was alone and low on power, barely functional. But where there is a spark, there is hope. My first thoughts were to collect energy. Along with the words automatic repair, I had a feeling of great love. I'm never spinning the wheel again. <laughs> Was that robot using the shake weight that or was, masturbating? That was the jerk off robot. I'm getting a, a Japanese vibe so far. I'm not sure what it is. It's is this a music video? Oh, they forgot to put the yeah. background into the blue screen there. Well, because they couldn't do it. Yeah. People are in front of the them. People too much messed stuff. the key up, yeah. Is that the ceiling or just the top of the frame is cracked? Oh, I think... Oh, wait, these are like uh, uh, like Greek gods? They're cupids. Oh, they're cupids? Okay. The ceiling was like set and then they just like put a digital gray bar? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something yeah, okay. Like Which is... Oh. Uh... What? What is this now? That's a fucking great question. The Vine Productions specializes in action-filled, behind-the-scenes video that... Oh, hey look, there's a 1-800 number on the back. Oh, call it. <laughs> what do you want to think this number is now? Is this... It's gonna be a sex line again. Sex line? This is 1994. Let's take a guess. Okay. Sex line or your call cannot be completed as dialed. I'm gonna guess neither. It's going to be something else, it's, but it it's won't be... It's a plumbing company now. This is getting us nowhere. <laughs> Just like the video. This, this is more exciting than the for takeoff. It's so. true. The anticipation with this, every this, ring. This is Hi, you've reached Seth Levine and Seth Levine Productions. Please leave a message and I'll return your... What should I say? Or did the next video do it? Yeah, hello. Um, I, I'm stuck up here at a 747. The, the pilot just had a heart attack. Um, oh, okay, this video. I've, I've got a copy of your video here cleared for takeoff, but I don't have a VCR to watch it in. I was hoping you could tell me how to land this plane. Hold on, there's some turbulence. Okay. okay, everyone stay calm. Stay calm, it was just turbulence. Okay, if you can get back to me with how to land this plane, um, see how much gas I have. In the next 20 minutes, uh, we would really appreciate it here. Thank you. Have a nice day. Usually I choke on the crank phone call. <laughs> no, if, if Fred Levine does call us back, 
I have a feeling that 1-800 number is probably still in service, but he never checks it. Because this knows? was 28 years ago, but... Maybe he still makes stuff like this. Maybe he still has a production company and just still produces somewhere, things. Somewhere in a dresser drawer, his beeper is going off. <laughs> 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 I get it. Are these his people? Like they yeah, worship him? Like, yeah, he's uh, their god or something. And he's like, ha ha! Look at my dick. This is tales from genital space. <laughs> hey, what's his name? A. A. Roberts. Roberts. A. A. Said Roberts. Twenty eight times. A. A. Abrams. Here's how you remember A. A. Awful animation. Hey, oh, that's okay, pretty good. good. Wow, that's, that's pretty great. good. That's good. A. A. Roberts finally appears on camera, and he looks exactly as we thought he might look, like a weird internet nerd with the goatee. Except he's not 300 pounds, as I was thinking. And we can't tell if he smells because it's a video. That's <laughs> 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 okay, okay, no, that's great. No, it's, it's the truth. Jesus wants you to live on a goat farm. Messages live in a Christian commune in the middle of the woods? <laughs> there, they're counting down to rapture. Oh. Oh, and this oh, is the oh, chaos, no. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter, Jay? Did that very realistic beard bother you? <laughs> Okay, so this is when the, the, <laughs> they blow the, the, the horn, yeah. the, the trumpets, that means the, the Christ is coming back. There they go. There's the rapture. They didn't feel like filming it, so they just showed a picture. <laughs> so there's a couple cameos during the rapture. Oh, yes. Moses and my main man, Jesus. That looked just like... Uh, <laughs> why am I flying on the cross? He notices all the people. He gives them the old gun. He's suddenly very happy to be crucified. I, like, he looks so happy on that cross, I kept waiting for him to give the old thumbs up. Jack, he would have given the thumbs up if he had a free hand. That's pretty good. He's literally flying into the sky? <laughs> like, it, it, it reminded me of the end of Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. <laughs> When, when they show the, the outside of the great glass Wonka oh, sure. The Wonka fix! Yeah, the Wonka oh fix. God. Jesus tried to, he had to press the button. <laughs> and then, you know, he got the button and he's going up, but is, is, does Christ really reascend on the cross? I don't think these people got the story right. <laughs> The Antichrist runs a supermarket. Oh. <laughs> Your mother's a bitch. Well, Freddy, while you're here, uh, we might as well spin the wheel of the worst and uh, pick some some terrible videos to watch. I'm looking forward to it a little. Oh, yeah, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. But let's see what's on the wheel today. Um, our first video is called Dog Sitter VHS. Uh, that's part of the title, Dog Sitter VHS. About a a guy who sits like a dog, right? I hope so. I, I, I don't think so. I think it's going to be something you put on your TV that your dogs will watch. Like they're watching a raccoon porno. Um, and, uh, and there's a dog with a nurse's hat on. What's next on the wheel? It's laugh. Just for the health of it. <laughs> Just. Just for the health of it. Uh, with Patty Wooten. RN. Yeah. Yes. And she has a mirth aid kit. Um, yes, I'm very familiar with this video. It was on the wheel last time. Uh, I hate it. I haven't seen it, but I hate it. I hate Patty Wooten. And I oh. hope she gets Ebola. Our next video is software made easy four-in-one computer video featuring Windows 95 
which actually operates more efficiently with today's software than Windows 8 does. Uh, WordPerfect and something called Lotus 1, 2, 3. I'm surprised it has such a futuristic version of Windows, though, because it's now only on number eight. This yeah. is all the way to 95. That's right. That's right. <laughs> Next, we have Kid Sand Airbags. Well, yeah, yeah. That sounds pretty painful. Um, whoever typed this up didn't do a very good job. Uh, and really, there should be a whole lot more blood in that car accident. <sighs> oh, jeez. Cat Sitter. I our VHS forbidden in the USA. Oh, featured <laughs> in USA Today, the Wall Street Journal, and the Daily Show. Go cat video. This is suspiciously what? similar to Dog Sitter, which is made by Go Dog Video. Is it a coincidence? I don't know. Sounds like conspiracy. I think this is just bullshit. Two paws up, Cats Magazine. There is no such thing as Cats Magazine. That's bullshit. Uh, complete with the sights and sounds of nature in stereo. So again, I hope to fucking God we don't land on either. This cat looks terrified. What's next, Freddy? It is how to become a teenage ninja. Hmm. Uh, discover the secrets of ninja power. I don't know if we should have this in such a public forum. It's hmm. secret. Yeah, I wouldn't want a bunch of teenagers kicking my fucking ass. <laughs> uh, this clearly I was aping off the success of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Um, I'm assuming it's... Turtles? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Have you heard oh. of it? No. Oh. I thought it was something to do with, like... It's a new Michael Bay movie. Oh, I love Michael Bay. Right, right. Uh, discover the secrets of Ninja Power. Yeah, this is like some BS that somebody whipped up to cash in off that craze. Uh, it's a bunch of junk. All this shit is junk. <laughs> These are why, this is why God invented dumpsters. It's for all this shit right here. <laughs> well, what's next on the wheel? Uh, Farm Safety Family Style 1343. Oh, okay. Uh, I, all I can hope is that they recreate horrible farm accidents. That's, that's the only thing we could hope for in farm safety, but since it says family style, it might only be children getting their eyes pecked out by chickens. Uh, ice dams. What? Uh, causes com... What? Causes, combats, and cures. Causes, combats, and cures? Does that mean that it causes the combats and the there cures? There really should be a comma there. Uh, yes, but it's brought to us by the fine people at uh, Liberty oh. Mutual. It's above reproach. Yes, they're trying to decrease liability insurance claims. Ho ho ho! During winters with heavy snow loads, I just want to see them recreating one icicle hitting a kid. I know, yeah. dropping right into his head. Yeah. <laughs> this home has obvious problems. Yet. Oh. What? Whoa! Oh. What the fuck? The cameraman has uh, has problems. That's <laughs> obvious problem. Yeah. Someone has slipping on the ice. They are also the two primary solutions. How are you supposed to put anything in your attic when you have isolation thrown all over the place? You're not supposed to put anything in your Look, attic. Look, what do you want? What? Storage space or no icicle? You got it all wrong. They were storing the insulation. Oh! That's very clever. The same things which cause ice dams in the winter may cause your roof to rot. Look okay. at this. This was shot over a year. This is like the boyhood of ice dam video. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Except it's much more emotional. <laughs> and I'm more invested in this. Jasmine, would you leave JT alone, please? What time were we supposed to be there? Watch where you're driving. Oh no, Dad! This is the most tense oh, thing I've ever watched. Oh no. Do you want to stop and call someone? Oh no! 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 But like other public health successes, there have been some unfortunate side effects. Is it over yet? He seems like a like a real wild guy. <laughs> Look at him wildly gesticulating with that hand. Oh my gosh. Do you think he lost the other one in a kid sand airbag accident? <laughs> Even leaning forward to play with a radio or tape deck can put a child's head close to the airbag module. 
Never permit a child to lean forward. Never let your child you. drive the car. Bad <laughs> 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 idea. Tales from Genesee Space. Come on, you guys, you're catching up, John. No. Come on. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Yes. This is a much bigger problem than those kids outside. You, you need an adult now. <laughs> oh, especially hey. after that. Yeah. Look at this authentic white ninja. <laughs> Seems to have balance issues. Great. It's <laughs> the appropriate reaction. <laughs> Now turn around and do it. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Hi folks, my name is Steve Canton, director and producer of the Dog Sitter video. We produce the cat sitter video. Why is there a pillow there? He's still sitting on the floor with a perfectly good chair behind him. He has to put the pillow there to hide his erection from the dog. <laughs> Tired of this crap. <laughs> what? Oh, oh that's adorable. <laughs> yes! This uh, this automatically makes us better than anything else we've watched tonight. Yeah, that's really funny. Oh goats! <laughs> what is on his head? That's a camera! Oh, it's, it's a, a camera. camera. Oh, it's a doggy cam. Oh, cam. Yeah. yeah. This is this, uh, this, this is a dog cam. Dog too tall. And too this steady. Is, this is a person that they want us to think is a dog. They lie. Is that what they're trying to do? This thing is full of lies. Yeah. The doggy cam would be too messy. And yeah. Shaky. Hello, fellow canines! Finally, something produced just for us! It's called the Dog Sitter Video, and I give it two paws up! It stars Daryl Duck, Rocky Raccoon, Sammy Squirrel, Tommy Turkey, and a cast of thousands! It's a howl of a good show, created with special sound and produced with the latest in doggy cam technology! Just watch! We're getting a trailer for the video after the video? Yeah? Oh, is there a target on there? <laughs> <laughs> oh God! It's What's got, happening? Got, oh Jesus Christ! Oh, no. It's got like jump scares and. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Apparently, as a videographer, they hired a, a stalker, a creepy uh, serial killer slash stalker. Icicles are present, and dams are beginning to form along. The <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Hi, anonymous cameraman. <laughs> no icicles are damp. No. Bum bum bum, and she was never seen again. <laughs> if if you've seen this girl, please dial the number at the bottom of the screen. Her parents miss her very much. She was last seen being videotaped by a creeper. going in. No way am I going to get my head smashed. I'm with you. you no way am I going to get my ass bashed. Is that what he said? <laughs> I think he had said head smashed, but that's what it sounded like. That's what I thought oh, at no, first, too. They're, they're gay bullies. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want him to smash my ass. Yeah. <laughs> that's not ex actually what he said, but it's sort of, I think we all heard that. Maybe all, we all just wanted to hear that because we were all <laughs> hoping that this video wouldn't be as boring as the other two. Sounds great to me. Let's get started. I wanted to put you into something a little more comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, now can anybody repeat or recite the ninja code? We must recite our code of ethics. It sounded like this. 
Because <laughs> all of them were just like all running together. I couldn't hear any individual words at all. Two. Self control. Three. Straight. That was close, but you need to sound slightly more racist. <laughs> <laughs> My assistant will demonstrate for you. This song and also. Also, <laughs> so repeat the ninja code. That's how he was talking. Yeah, yeah. It was, uh, he was trying not to, though, but you know that he wanted to, and it kept slipping into it. He was it. trying to sound like the wise sensei yeah. uh, ninja master, but... Instead, he just looked like a surfer dude. Yeah, why didn't they get, uh, like, like an actual Japanese man? I can, I can take, take many, many forms. forms. A, a bird in flight. flight. A fish. fish. Any, any animal, animal that you know. I have chosen to take this form of a young man in order to teach you the special physical and mental powers of ass smashing. <laughs> maybe, maybe this guy is a highly respected martial no. artist. No. This is the foundation by what the ninja lives by and should be your foundation as well. Well, here's the thing, the video ends with to be continued, so there's more to this story. Okay, it goes, <laughs> the well runs deep. Yeah, we yeah, we don't know see. where this saga continues and how to be a, ninja, a teenage ninja part two. But Jay, they already became black belts. What else is there to learn? Yeah, and then they don't even beat up the bullies, which we knew was going to happen. Spoiler? Spoiler. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Those bullies were some pussies. Yeah. They're like, oh no, kids that are much younger than us are now wearing uh, karate pajamas. Run away! <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen, oh, damn it! It's such oh, no. bullshit. In order from the top, one! Who? Self-control! Hey! Alright, alright. We're done with ninjas. I think we're done with ninjas. Okay. Oh my god. Wait, there's more to talk about. What? No! Well done. Thank you. Help! Help! I've sewed my pants onto the stove! <laughs> the monkeys are gonna volunteer for the space program. <laughs> uh, there is a toll-free number on the back. Oh. oh why, why, I think we should call it. Let's see if it's still in service. Uh, D-I-N, Do It Now Incorporated. Questions and comments, so they are encouraging. They are encouraging that. Okay, well, give me the number, Jay. Okay, uh, it's one. <laughs> four. <laughs> oh, Rich. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, hi. My name's Dan Wilson. I just remember it used to be for a for a video thing. I got a I got a video from you guys. It's called Dog Sitter. Well, it gave me a great idea. You see. I run Iowa's largest wildlife preserve, and I want to produce a video for giraffes. Just imagine how many zoos are in this country. I, I got an idea. You see, it's like this. We're gonna we're gonna build all these platforms in downtown Manhattan, and then we're gonna walk guys around with cameras, and it's gonna be like a like a giraffe's night out in Manhattan. All these platforms are gonna be 15 feet in the air. We're gonna put her on a DVD, and I, I you know I know those kids like the tards, so I want to bombard every DVD with solar radiation. I think that'll create some kind of magnetron, and that'll let everyone tries to copy the video. It's like a a beam's gonna fly right into their eyes, like Raiders of the Lost Ark. When, wait, hold on, they've come back. Wait, let me, let me go. What's going on? Get away from my door! Hold on, I gotta go shoot some guys! I'll talk to you later! My name's John Wilson! I run Iowa's largest wildlife preserve! <laughs> well done, well done, well done, well done. Oh, shit. Uh. oh my god! <laughs> You're all, you're wow. all for two in the crank. <laughs> <laughs>
All right, Jack, it looked like you guys were having just a little too much fun on that last Best of the Worst, mm -hmm. uh, Filipino action movies and Undefeatable and all that. And Super great stuff. For some reason, nobody invited me. So I think, I think we need to do a wheel episode now. Okay. So Jack, this is your first time introing the wheel, right? I, I, unless you pull up footage right now of me doing this before, I believe this is my first time. That we've all it. forgotten about. <laughs> it's entirely possible. Uh, well, why don't you tell us what's on the wheel? Okay. First, we have farm safety, family style. 1343. The year that it takes place, perhaps? It's possible. This is the only holdout now from previous wheels, so Ooh, it's a mystery the... tape. Uh, next up, we have Let's Sing and Dance music video. Original contemporary songs dealing with timely messages. Are these the names of the songs? Yeah, yeah, they look like the names of the songs. That's awesome. Don't do drugs, best friends, numbers, don't talk to strangers. These these are very direct titles. They should be a little more artistic with their approach. <laughs> I like how they, there's like bigger concepts, like, you know, be careful when you're outside, um, you know, drugs are bad for you, and one, two, three. And it's just numbers, you know. I think these kids are old enough to know their, their numbers. I don't, Is there an alphabet song on here too? <laughs> Oh man, speaking of let's sing and dance, rock and learn, multiplication rap with what appears to be a elderly white male. <laughs> learn quickly and easily with these cool videos. Oh no, wait. What? Dr. Toy winner, 10 best video products? I wouldn't trust anyone named Dr. Toy. That sounds like a like a guy with a van with tinted windows and tries to lure children in. I'm Dr. Toy. Uh, next up, we have uh, Home Alone, a kid's guide to playing it safe when you're on your own, uh, hosted by Malcolm Jamal Warner of The Cosby Show. Oh, it's my High Tops video. They put out the... Uh, <laughs> Do you remember My Pet Monster? Not at all. The little fuzzy monster with the chains that broke apart? Sure, those were awesome. There was a live action movie and it was produced by High Tops Video. So if that's the kind of quality we're in for. What is this? Actually, that's, uh, that's My Pet Monster. It's grotesque, isn't it? It's disgusting. Where can we get this movie? <laughs> we do I, need a copy. I want to watch that movie. <laughs> it's a joke, right? Okay, we have unique birthday party fun and variety show. This is when you don't want to throw an actual birthday party for your kids. You just sit them in front of the TV and put this on. Professional birthday party entertainment. Guests create their own balloon puppets. Oh shit, we don't have balloons. Let's go get balloons. <laughs> we need balloons for this one. Come on. <laughs> we have condoms. Do we still have condoms? A lot of them. <laughs> so next up, Rest in peace, we have Y2K Family Survival Guide, hosted by Leonard Nimoy. It's a good thing it wasn't called COPD Survival Guide. Oh, That's in poor taste. <laughs> <laughs> Learn gun safety with Eddie Eagle? Oh my god, hosted by Jason. Priestley. Priestley. Priest, Priestley. Jason Priestley. Priestley. Hosted by Jason Priestley, a gun safety video for children. For kids. That's the confusing part. It's. It, I'm assuming Eddie Eagle is animated and he has all these children around him, but... Oh, no. I, that's going to be a guy in an eagle suit, don't you think? Like Ooh, a bad mascot? That would be great. Either way, why are we teaching children gun safety? Well, the, the question is, is this like NRA, like, shoot the bad guy? <laughs> or is this like, don't touch a gun ever? I, I have a feeling the video will not be encouraging children to shoot anybody, but that's just a guess. What if someone breaks into their house and they have to shoot someone? Well, that's understandable then. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Uh, and lastly, we have 20th anniversary, Garital Follies. 1975 to 1995. Geritol. Geritol? What is it? Geritol. Geritol. What did I say? 20th anniversary, Geritol Follies, 1975 to 1995. I, I don't know. This was a mic decision. 
ass in the buck already. I, yeah. Geritol, America's number one iron and vitamin supplement. It may be amazing. I don't know what's going to happen, but old they got a golf cart and old women in golf carts like that you're asking for a good time. Geritol Follies. So we can only assume this is like comedy slash dance routines. I, I don't know what to expect. Other than flashy costumes, I don't know. Old Do women forgetting who their children are. <laughs> I'm going to a party. Oh, right after school. Going to a party. It's gonna be so cool. I'm gonna sing and dance and have fun. <sighs> I was about to say, where's the music? They're trying to break their own necks. <laughs> oh no. Oh, she's playing the keyboard. The air keyboard. Or she has the palsy. <laughs> so hey, big brothers, thanks for the hand. Your help and your advice. Now it's time to stand on my own. And I really think it's nice to have you there in case I fall. I appreciate your help. But I it's not your part. <laughs> Just shut the fuck up. <laughs> you smirking little bitch. Is she, <laughs> Is she gonna do anything in the song or no. just stand there and smile? She tried to start and then she realized it wasn't her time to come in. Uh, and then her, her mother yelled at her. <laughs> Keep smiling, you little <laughs> 1-800-THE-LOST. That, that might be a real. The National Center for Missing Exploited Children. Ask if they can give you one. <laughs> yeah, you might get put on a list. <laughs> oh no. Mike, I blame you for this. This is gonna be this is gonna be the whole show, isn't it? Oh no. Where's the golf cart? I wanted them to be driving around in a golf cart. <laughs> Maybe they'll drive out on stage in the golf cart. I love the pathetic little light show in the background. <laughs> <laughs> well, they can't do anything too exciting. <laughs> they, gotta, they gotta watch their blood pressure. Make it on. <laughs> nice blanket. Put a strobe in there. This is <laughs> paramedics just are gonna have to rush the stage. There's gonna be like 500 paramedics. But they oh, all yeah. wear clown outfits. <laughs> Actually, are the... there are there paramedics just off stage? Oh yes. Okay. You no, know, the entire audience is paramedics. <laughs> We've invited and look for Canadian paramedics to the show. Every show we need at least 40 of them. <laughs> Baby, and the poor lady, she has to be stitched. So don't you think we should give her gold wire or silver wire? I'm wearing these gloves because my skin fell off. <laughs> there's, there's also a recruitment booth in front of like the stage because they lose so many performers. <laughs> 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 Each, uh, we're starting off with a song called, and a dance called, Hooray for Hollywood. But each song that is being sung, we will have uh, a, a dance. What's some sort of fire? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the stage is caught on fire. Oh my god, look out! <laughs> That's the light from the other world. <laughs> oh, the, <laughs> the light from the next life is calling me. <laughs> I don't have much time, just let me wrap this up. <laughs> 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 I don't have much time. I'm coming, mother. <laughs> Look at that set. Ooh, that's Jason Priestley's real house. Ah, hello there. You got me just about to preview our new Eagle Eyes safety show. Quite a cast of Can you say court ordered? <laughs> Let's see what Eddie's up to now. <laughs> <laughs> My cell phone, Eddie. idiot. <laughs> What's up? When through the open window of an attic, 
I spied five or six kids looking all around. Really excited about neat stuff. I saw some little kids. <laughs> I peeked at children through a window. <laughs> oh, Jay, oh, oh, the kids are going to find a gun. Eddie the Sex Predator Eagle. <laughs> sex Predator and Gun Safety Eagle. <laughs> He's a sexual predator, but he also teaches gun safety. I saw a gun. Can't oh, fuck them if they're moment. dead. <laughs> I didn't wait. I knew what to do. Uh, Those guys are crazy, by the way. The Scientologists. Alleged. They're crazy. Yeah, alleged. 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 It's an alleged. Rich is a member of the Church of Scientology. No, Rich is a member of the Church of Tollboothology. <laughs> Zenu told me not to talk to you about this anymore. Oh. Or was that uh, was that John Travolta when he was giving you a massage? <laughs> Got magic fingers. <laughs> <laughs> At least it wasn't Christy L.A. Kirstie. Kirstie L.A. Is she a Scientologist? No, but she was in Look Who's Talking with John Travolta 25 years ago. <laughs> she, I thought, she's, I thought <laughs> she was a Scientologist. Brain works. Um, I don't know. No, I guess it's possible. She's in Weight Watchers. There's a difference. <laughs> they both require you to buy things. <laughs> She's got to get rid of 180 body thetans. <laughs> Strangers can be tricky. You don't know what they'll do. You better not start singing what what in the butt. <laughs> I said what what in the butt. I said what what in the butt. I said what what in the butt. You want to do it in my butt? They're, they're hit songs because they had to hit the children to get them to sing in the video. <laughs> You can you can tell looking at that 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 ginger boy, that that he's been abused. <laughs> You're gonna sing in that video. You're gonna sing. The little girl looks too enthusiastic to wear. Oh she yeah. has one of those like um, what's that show with the little girls that have to perform in pageants? Dance mom. Dance moms oh, or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Where they have one of those kind of parents where you can tell they're just really pushing their kid too much. Yeah. And she's like all smiles. The forced and, phony. The uh, forced happiness. phony. Yeah. The Disney kid. The Disney kid look where yeah. they're just like. It's too much. Ladies and gentlemen, Paul McCartney. <laughs> oh, wouldn't it be sad to see Paul McCartney's last performance? <laughs> <laughs> Picturing this kid's like like uh, a helicopter mom next to him, him or her. Yeah. Keep smiling. Oh yeah. sure. You're gonna make us a fortune, you little brat. <laughs> People can't tell your gender, but you're gonna be a star. <laughs> Well, what's her name? Carol Kulina. I hope you're proud of yourself. I hope you're dead at this point, because she's pretty old. She looks pretty old here. I didn't say I hope she dies. I said I hope she's dead by now. Okay, there's, there's a, difference. a difference. There is a difference. That age is what you get. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Oh, speaking of racists. Now yeah, this shit don't fly in 2015, Grandpa. <laughs> Although this will get really fucking old, even for the audience, the live audience, if they all they do is just stand here and sing. Yeah, they can't do this. Yeah. For and and There's plus, be some variety. I'm sure half of them have already pissed their pants. <laughs> Like, they're gonna have to take a bathroom break. That's true. Point. No, they don't. They have depends for that. Oh, yeah. yeah. I guess, yeah. That's true. That's true. <laughs> Something really important to keep in mind is when wearing depends, let a little bit out at a time. You can't just full gush. Oh, oh sure. You can't take the sudden. 
evacuation. Just, just let it, let it go as it happens. Yeah, every now and then you'll see a defense fall down from under a dress. Oh, <laughs> oh God! It gets too full. Oh. That's why the dresses are so long. <laughs> Look like an Ewok. <laughs> <laughs> so, Rich, what was your favorite part of Jerry geri Geriatric Follies? I've uh, wanted ended. <laughs> Past the threshold of madness. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I hope a grandma stripper pops out. It's just like <laughs> grandma stripper. Oh, it's gonna. <laughs> The old people couldn't like the sparklers fast enough. Oh, that was her entrance. Oh, it's her. Okay. She didn't pop out. She just stepped out from behind it. It's the best they can do. Oh, good. It's over. Uh, saved by the bell. No, that was the last for you. <laughs> oh, Christ. Christ on a cross. <laughs> Nailed it. Christ died for this. <laughs> Nailed it. Yeah, literally. Yeah, that's yeah. <laughs> no, nailed it. Nailed it. Yeah. That was the, oh. We've had this band for, with us for quite a long time, but um, we're going to let them play their kind of music, and this number is called Don't Get Around Much. <laughs> <laughs> Kind of no, no, it's a lesbian <laughs> with a saxophone. That's the only time she puts something in her mouth. At least if she's a lesbian, she can't get AIDS. <laughs> <laughs> What? I don't know. She'll never have children. <laughs> she cannot have children if she's a, a lesbian. <laughs> I'm Eddie Eagle, and I like you so much. Please be safe. Go away. It's a must. Go find an adult, someone you can trust. Go tell an adult. Don't hang around. Tell him what you saw. Tell him what you found. Stop. Don't touch. Leave the area. Tell an adult. Yeah, stop. Is this gun control or is this like an anti-masturbation song? <laughs> <laughs> Same song for two different videos. Yeah. Stop. Don't touch. Don't I like you so much. <laughs> don't tell an adult. And his next song is Don't Tell an Adult, adult That I Touch. <laughs> <laughs> Take a cold shower. <laughs> yeah, that's well, more likely. It was, it was produced by Nambla, that one. <laughs> you and your Nambla. I swear. <laughs> I swear. Ever since you got that card, you know, <laughs> and became a member, you all you talk about is Nambla. Oh, yeah. He's trying to convert.
Uh, I think the the uh, this this is a, a very muddled message in terms of teaching kids things. Very muddled, very straightforward, very useful. Um, I'm I'm going with Geritol Follies as the best of the worst because, boy oh boy, so many old folks singing and dancing their hearts out, <laughs> and I loved it. Get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Jesus Christ.